Hello and welcome to Hornbill TV. Another candlelight service was held as a tribute to the slain Konyak brethren at Old MLA Hostel in Kohima on Sunday night. Speaking at the event on behalf of the Eastern Nagaland Legislators Union, Minister for Soil and Water Con Conservation, Geology and Mining V. Kashiho Sangtam condemned the gruesome act of genocide in which scores of civilians were slain at Oting village in Mon district of Nagaland. Terming the Armed Forces Special Powers Act as a draconian act, which has killed many people since its implication in 1958, he informed that Nagaland government has passed a gap cabinet memo to abrogate AFSPA to the government of India. He also informed that a special investigation team has been set up to investigate the incident that took place on December 4th, adding that a major general was pitched in to set up a court inquiry to probe the incident. The murder of our very own sons and brothers. And we, as Eastern women of Kohima, strongly condemn this barbaric act of the security forces, ASPA, and what they have done. It is a great loss, but with due respect, may I mention that they have not died in vain. Because when the entire world thinks that we have been divided and fallen, this incident has proven to the world that Nagas are one. President of Eastern Naga Public Union Kohima and Tushi Chang said that the incident has proven to be world to the world that Nagas are one and no political power or military power can take this oneness away from us. President of Eastern Nagaland Women Organization Lee Mai B. Pom, Kohima Unit also made an appeal to the government to take up the issue with utmost seriousness to bring justice to the people at the earliest. She also called upon all mothers to take good care of their family and children and to maintain peace and harmony in the society.